like um recently i matched with a doctor on a dating app and i was just like you know i said you know what do you do he's like i'm a doctor and he was just like i was like, okay so what's your goals he and he was just like oh no i kind of blocked you because like what do you mean was what's my goals is a doctor not enough well i got three jobs Dumbass. you got three jobs you didn't say three companies <laughs> you didn't say you had uh three stock portfolios worth billions of you said three jobs <laughs> And that's why your job having ass is gonna get a Turquavion with his non job having ass. Cause your dumb ass was gonna turn down a surgeon. You know what, see, I was gonna, but I'm, I'm gonna direct what? this to my man over uh -oh. here real okay. quick. Okay. When is being a doctor not enough to date a woman? Were you dealing with people what? with mental health? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me repeat it. When is being a doctor not enough to get a date with a... No, but let me rephrase that. When is being a doctor not enough to get a date from a black woman? It's like, let me stop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, hey. I love my black women. So do I. Yeah, hey. Oh, Lord, yes. My mama's a black woman. My mama's my a My thing black is, woman. ain't nothing wrong with standards, but come on now. There's, a goddamn doctor. There's there's a difference between standards and delusion. And yeah. we'll, we'll see what this video is, because yeah. I don't know. I, I need to see this video. It, yeah. it sounds very delusional. It's this Jump Podcast. Oh. Let's go. Like, um, recently I matched with a doctor on a dating app. And I was just like, you know, I said, well, you know, what do you do? He's like, I'm a doctor. And he was just like, I was like, okay, so what's your goals? He, and he was just like, oh, no, I kind of blocked you because, like, what do you mean? Was What's my goals? Is a doctor not enough? I don't want somebody who's content with where they are. A doctor is being, being a doctor is amazing. I understand what you guys go through to get there, but why can't you want more? I guess me having three jobs shows you that I'm never comfortable with being in one place. Child, not being a doctor. He, he need to run for the president. He's mm -hmm. already a surgeon, and that ain't enough for you. <laughs> it's not it's not a money thing more so i guess it's an ambition thing hold on let me go first let me go first let me go first hold on I, I need the young women the old women my allergies are bothering me but bear with me this unstable creature <laughs> said that it's not about the money it's about the ambition do you know how young many lady, years it takes do you know that how, is the pinnacle of career to be a doctor and that's that doesn't just, even that's include, just plain old doctor. And that doesn't even include the clinical. She said surgeon. Oh my! He was God. a surgeon. He's a surgeon. So what? There's no. There, there, you can't get what? higher than that. Exactly. He's at the highest part of medical field. He is at the pinnacle, girl, what of his profession. And then your stupid ass says what something ambition like, "Do he really need that?" Well, I got three jobs. Dumbass. You got three jobs. You didn't say three companies. <laughs> you didn't say you had uh, three stock portfolios worth billions of. You said three jobs. <laughs> and that's why your job having ass is gonna get a Turquavion with his non-job having ass because your dumb ass was going to turn down a surgeon. <laughs> surgeon! If he's black, they're probably like 6% of, of the medical field are black surgeons. Right. It might even be less. So if he was a black surgeon, he's even more rare with your dumb three job having ass. So stay your stupid ass over there with the rest of them stupid ass girls. And guess what? Let the real women get the surgeons and the good yes, guys. Please. Because your dumb ass deserves Turquavion who works at the gas station, Pendot, and Popeyes. You idiot. <laughs> now y'all can go. I'm tired of this. I'm so tired of these type of women. Oh, here. I need to see what ambitious. Amb He's a doctor. How many doctors do you know? And I ain't talking about Dr. Hoxtable. Oh, I wish I could say some real curse words on here. We be Hold demonetized up. quickly. Oh, my God. Hold on, go ahead, hey, T. You want to go, T? I'm going no, after you, T. No, he, he, done, he done said it all. Hey, like, yeah. Look, I, he just done dropped the mic on that one. Look, look. <laughs> Piss me off. Listen. A surgeon makes anywhere between Give me a shot of that bad dog, because now she done pissed uh, me off. He Shit, makes, it's way more than 200. Oh, no, anyway, I would say anywhere between 200 to 500,000. Yes. yes. Because he is at the pinnacle of his career. He literally deals with life and death yes. every day. There's some you know how much that, money he's bringing some in? some people that don't wake up from that table when he's done. Right. Unfortunately. Oh, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. So, when I clipped the video, every job that she had, and it, it was no more than like a job that 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 you had to have nothing nothing more than like our certificate for. 
That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? Because here oh it is. God. It's like, okay, so she's in the same room as him in the medical field, but he's way higher than her. Why the hell? The boy was a goddamn surgeon. He's a exactly. surgeon. Yeah, I mean, a you, surgeon. <laughs> if anything, she used. She need to use her words against hers. Where the hell is her ambition? Uh, well, see, her aunt, see, she thinks working three jobs makes her ambitious. No, that's just stupid. No, at the no, end of the day, working three jobs make you broke. Right, because at the end of the day, you working all damn day and you not doing nothing else to progress your life. Whereas though he has his one job and he, I bet he can do whatever, whenever, he probably however does. he wants because he has whatever money that he ever possibly needs. He probably and she's does still struggling. in 30 days. He probably does ten surgeries in a month, and probably makes three to four hundred thousand. Probably so more imagine, than that. Imagine going to work. I, I think probably more than that. More, imagine going to that. work ten days out of a month. Right. Imagine that. And so her stupid ass Goodness, said great. ambition. It, do you? He was broke as hell in school. Broke because all he was doing was probably going to school. Came out of school with probably half a million dollars in, in, in student loans. And guess what? I bet they paid off. Mm -hmm. This is why I hate women like this. I'm sorry. I have to say it. I hate women like this. Because at the end of the day, it's it's younger women and women who are not educated enough that will see this woman and be like, yup, she right. Yeah, but see, that's why like, I always the say hell? it's a difference between just because she's a female doesn't necessarily categorize her as a woman. Like me, that's how I think, because it's like, OK, yes, I can be a female, but am I yeah. a woman or am I a girl? Yeah. You know, so Young. her mindset is just so immature. But see, but now now she that was uh, <clears throat> excuse me. That was a clip from Kendra G. Kendra yeah, G. I, shout out to Kendra Singles G. Live. I watched that. Oh, wow. Yeah, I she, mean, and I ain't gonna lie, it's very entertaining. And she gonna very, stay single with, with that mindset. But very yeah, but some some of the people, and I don't want to just say just women, because it be men who going to going through there with like delusionals and Damien. Yeah, you know I mean, what I mean, it's not just women, of course. It's women yeah. and men. Yeah, I mean, but I'm, I'm, but the, the, but, the yeah, one but thing, that BS that she just said is just crazy. But the one thing I can say about. The men versus the women is, and this is not to like pit women against men, but the women be having stand, be having uh like qualifications and oh, and those they high be, expectations. I, like most of the men. The oh my bad. But most of the men just want like a good woman who's not combative, and it it be it be normally the same thing. The women be like, I want you to be an astronaut. I want you to know <laughs> Jesus firsthand. And I want you to drive six Bugattis in, 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 in one day. And I want you to live in a uh, in a 42,000 square, 42, square feet high mansion. high expectations. And then and it's you like, got to okay, only have swag What are you doing fish to contribute and, to this and lifestyle? Like, bro, like, the, the people y'all be asking for, this is why I liked Kevin Samuels. It's like, is gave, this realistic? He gave yeah. numbers. No. Or like, when women be like, oh, I want a man that makes 100K. Now, we're going to talk about black black women. If you want a black man that makes 100K, that's 8% of the population. Mm -hmm. Eight. The average black man makes $44,000 a year. So you're asking for a small percentage of just the available men. That's not That doesn't include men who are uh, homosexual, men who are incarcerated, men who are disabled, and then men who just don't want to date black women. So it's the pool is even smaller. Yeah. So yep. when y'all have these outrageous standards and qualifications, it's like you sound stupid. Yeah, and it's then just it's like, so, okay, you know what? Come on, ladies. Let's be realistic. Let's be realistic. And that's what, again, I said it before in a previous episode. As men, we know I'm not a 10 so I already know if I'm trying to get to the tens, the the things that the tens want, I know as a man, I'm five foot seven, barely. Most women, they like tall men. So I already know that's one niche off my my number. I can't be a 10 because I don't fit in that in that realm. It just is what it is. Yeah. That's just a standard. Cool. They want men they uh that make a certain amount of money. Okay, I can fit into that. Or they want men that don't have children. I got three. So it's like I'm realistically knowing that I'm going to be in a certain box. Women, I seen one woman on the Kendra G show. She had five kids. She had just had a baby about three months ago. She said, oh, I got wow. three. She breastfeeding Damn. baby on the thing. What? Damn. Kendra like, well, where's the dad? I don't want to talk about him. He is such a mess. And I'm, it's like, why would I want to date? You got a three-year-old sucking on your nipple. A three -month -old. I'm trying to suck on your nipple. <laughs> <laughs> so, I, I can't take it up. I can't take food from the baby. So I don't Man, want to. I like this, boy. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs>
Put little Junior. Put little Junior. Put little Junior to sleep. Hey. Well, I'm moving the, the fuck out of it. Like. It's just weird, man. <laughs> they be doing too much. I yeah, hey. We gotta go to the comments. Man, we we, go, we gotta go to the comment. Take. We gotta go to the comment. Take. Comments. Go all ahead. right. All right. All right. So one one comment is from any black man. Any black man says, "I give up, bro." I, I'm with you. Oh, look. yeah, I'm man. With you, I go, yeah. I'm with it, you. It, it, what can we do? What, yeah. What 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 is it that I really can do? Like <laughs> this is why I keep saying we need the real women. I know y'all might not be on social media and all of that. We need y'all to come in groves and come and put a new narrative out there because we're seeing too many of these women. We need y'all to come out and show that y'all exist. Too much on the forefront. We're seeing too many of these. So, so next comment. Next comment is from Cat. Cat says she says I'm not even a man and I give up. Listen, Cat. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> hey, hey. Cat. Yeah, we love you, Cat. Yeah, I mean, Cat. See, Cat is one of the realest ones. Yeah, that that it's chick is crazy. Just, uh, delusional. <laughs> what? Delusional. It's crazy. Yeah, I mean, but you know they them dudes, they got some good coochie. And that's, and fellas, fellas. You don't always get <laughs> don't get you know what, Lowe's? Uh, I what you say? Don't Look, get do you the want track. the good or do you want, you know, somebody that's gonna bring you some I'll take the piece over the P. I'm sorry. <laughs> I take the piece over the P. But 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 but, but 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 <laughs> But the the because you the already toxic, said that them, them them girls is crazy. But you already the, said the, it. The, the crazy toxic women are only for night work. You're not supposed to be wifing them up. No, You're not supposed to be letting them spend the night. Leave, they they want to say that's just night work, they and then you leave get them out. Easy. Listen. Look, look, we just had a video where a girl that didn't want to fucking leave. Listen. That's why you gotta say you know I work overnight, and you can't stay in my oh house my by gosh. yourself. Listen. <laughs> Ladies, if you ain't allergic to Look. coconut oil, again, we can we can fix it. Look, she can act like she sleep. Look, she can act like she sleep. Oh, okay, I'll just leave in the morning. I'll lock the bottle now. No, ain't no morning. No, nah, ain't no morning shit. <laughs> yeah, I mean, ain't no morning. You know, I'll I lock the bottle. Now, like, listen, no, listen, ain't no got, bottom lock. I'm like, oh, listen, you know baby girl. I'll, I'll stay until you get here. When you nah, get back, I'm here now. now. I'm, I, I'm <laughs> here in spirit. You know what I would say? I'm gonna tell you. This is what I would say. But listen here, baby girl. My, when my roommate get home, he, you know, what I mean. He like to take shit. What's his name? His name is uh, Zion. Sean Combs. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I don't think, think you want to be here when he get home. <laughs> uh, he's take start, that, take that. He's, <laughs> he starts to freak off around 3.30. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that, what's your roommate name? Sean Combs. Uh, sometimes he goes by Brother Love. <laughs> you know, he starts take to freak off at 3.30 in the that. morning. So. <laughs> All right, look, look, so let's go. Let's go to one more comment. Last comment. Last comment is from Eric Thomas, four ninety five. What's good, Eric? Eric says, "Wow, you can't make this up. You can't. You can't. Ain't that ain't that what Brother Samuel said? Yeah, you, you can't. Said you can't make this shit. You can't make this up. It's crazy. Like, okay, y'all don't want men to cheat. Y'all want men to be emotionally intelligent. You know, what? sometimes I think these chicks be saying stuff just for the attention. It's I, like, again, I believe I do too. I think I'm so, with you on that. I'm like, with you on that. Do you really believe what you're saying? I do too. I think it's to go viral and so they can put a booking uh, thing in a uh, bio for bookings. Reach out to. Broke girl at <laughs> gmail.com. Broke girl. <laughs> yeah, like you read out the broke bitch. <laughs> Damn. It's it's a, it's crazy out here, fellas. Stay stay strong. Stay true to yourself. Man. Get you some coconut oil, and you what's can, the coconut oil that's for? That's to help fix the, the the girls that may not have the the, the uh that little snapback. Yeah, it helps. A little vinegar, coconut oil. It'll pull it all together. Trust I thought me. I thought he was about to say it's to help. Wait a minute, yeah, help to uh, I was, I masturbate. Was, that's what I thought no, he was no, about no, to no. say. I was like, well, shit. You like? I guess you like your Johnson. No, I heard vinegar and coconut oil makes it kegel a little bit. Oh, get out! That's what I heard. Don't right. quote me on that. So they should do that. The the, the coconut oil, vinegar, and coconut oil mm -hmm. with so some kegels, keep it nice and strong mm -hmm. and tight. T know about the kegels. I know about something else. Okay, you know thank y'all for showing up <laughs> tonight. Uh -huh. So we gonna go to comment number four. <laughs> <laughs> comment number four is from what's this? See you later. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, bitches. <laughs>